Why does blood have that metallic taste like copper or iron? Think about it. When you were a kid, you've probably cut your finger and sucked on it to stop the bleeding. We've probably all done that, even recently as an adult. And we've probably all wondered why the blood tastes metallic, has that copper or iron taste. It's because your blood actually contains iron. Meet hemoglobin. It's a protein molecule in your red blood cells, and it's the part of your blood that moves the oxygen you breathe into your lungs to your body tissues, and then takes the carbon dioxide back to your lungs so you can breathe it out. And hemoglobin contains iron. Here's an interesting fact. The average person has about three to four grams of iron in their body. That's about the same amount of iron that's in a three inch nail. We've also got copper in our blood too. It rides around in your blood with a protein that's called ceruloplasmin. Most adults have somewhere between 50 and 80 milligrams of copper in their bodies, and most of it is in their muscles and their liver. We need copper for strong bones and connective tissues, as well as a whole bunch of other stuff. All animals, all vertebrates anyways, do the same thing. They breathe in oxygen and breathe out carbon dioxide, and the hemoglobin in their red blood cells makes it all possible, just like you and me. Animals have ceruloplasmin too, the protein that carries around copper. So if you're wondering if animal blood also tastes like iron or copper, the answer is yes. Animal blood would taste very similar to ours. Subscribe now for more answers to life's most interesting questions.